Hi, I'm Bobby, and today I want to take time to show you this very unusual board. It's something that I've never seen, and I don't know if you've seen it before or not. But what it is, it's a piece of walnut wood. It's a board that's actually been through a sawmill, and it's been planed and everything, and it's full of bullets. Looks like full metal jacket bullets. Now, I'm not sure what kind of bullets they are or how long they've been in there. If you know what kind of bullet it is or have any idea, maybe you could... Leave a comment in the comment section because I'd be interested to know. Um, I don't know how you'd tell by looking at it like this, but it looks like either a brass or a um, copper outer shell or a lining filled with lead. And it looks like to me, if you can look at it real close, they've been in there for a really long time, especially like these over here. Can tell i see a little bit of disturbance around where the bullets are but it looks like they've been in that walnut tree long enough for the wood to have grown back around it and it's just like a i guess you'd call it like a, maybe a one by six maybe just a little less than six inches and here's a close-up of what it looks like and it's just full of these things all over and uh not only did it go through the sawmill like this it went through the planer and uh it's kiln dried walnut and the people at the sawmill said that they didn't worry about it so much because the lead is soft and it doesn't hurt the machinery and uh, i don't know what i'm going to do with this board i'll get back a little bit away from it and let you kind of get an idea of what it looks like it's probably about seven feet long And uh, I've got it up on my work table, so you can't really get a full view of it. And at the top of it, I'm going to roll the board over and look at it like that. You can see some little specks on the other side. So they're on both sides of the board. I'm going to pull it on down this way a little bit. And you can see... They're on both sides. So it's a lot of them. You can really see the brass or around the lead right there. And look at that. That's a perfect view of it. Look at that. Take a picture of that. And uh, I don't know whether to just keep it as a board because it's unusual. It's something that you don't generally see. If something could be made out of it because of its size you tell me in the comments what do you think if you can think of something that would be cool to make out of it and I decide that I want to make it maybe I'll make a video of me cut, cutting it up and making something out of this so I'll let you decide what do you think I should make out of this board should I cut it up or should I leave it like it is? It's just not something that you see every day. Look at that. Right here it looks like one bullet hit another bullet. And you can kind of see right over here where it looks like it, the metal on the outside of it kind of scrunched up when it hit the other bullet and it's contoured to it. You come on down this way. That's a good shaped one. So leave a comment. Oh, look, there's another one where one bullet actually hit another bullet. Oh, I guess that's what that is. So leave a comment in the comment section and tell me what kind of bullets you think these are. How long they've been in this piece of wood. And should I cut this board up and make something out of it? And if yes, what should I make out of it? And I'll make a video of, of me making something out of it. No matter what it is. I guess you could make a picture frame. Or a box maybe. I just don't know. But I do know there's enough area. In the board. It's probably like about a three foot stretch. Or a section in the board. Where it has these bullets. Now the rest of the board. As you go on down. As you can see. Doesn't have any bullets down there. So it's a very specific part of the tree. And again. It's a piece of walnut wood. That's been through a sawmill, been through the planer, it's kiln dried, and it's full of these bullets. 
So let me know what you think. What, what do you think about this? What kind of bullets they are? What should I make out of this? Leave a comment. And y'all have a good day. And I'm, and thanks for watching Get Go TV. And check out some of my other videos. It's got a lot of videos where I restore stuff. And there's some home improvement videos. A little bit of something for everybody. And subscribe to the channel. So that you can see more videos that we upload. I have a whole pile of stuff that I'm going to be restoring. And neat stuff like this that I might make things out of. So it's definitely would be a good thing to do would be to subscribe to the channel get go tv and hit the notification bar so that you know when i upload a video that way you can watch all the videos right when they come out and I'm, i've got a lot of interesting neat things that i'm going to be doing i want to be making videos of so y'all have a good day and make sure to leave a comment and tell me what you think this is and there it is that's it